Hi everyone, so today we're starting a new series of videos which uh, we're going to feature the top 10 restaurants in Krakow um, as determined by the viewers of TripAdvisor. So people who go into TripAdvisor and uh, make their ratings and reviews of all of the, the different restaurants in Krakow that they go to TripAdvisor consolidates all that and then when you search the restaurants it shows you out of all the restaurants w how well they were rated. So a couple of weeks ago went on TripAdvisor and searched for the top 10 restaurants and these are the restaurants that it came up with. So for the next few weeks we're going to visit all 10 and give you our thoughts on each of them, our favourites and so on. And tonight we're going to bring you number seven and eight, Crudo and Interligatonia. Enjoy. Can you hear the wind? It's a stormy last Sunday of January in Krakow. So to keep warm, we decided this is uh, one of the top 10 best rated restaurants in Krakow per TripAdvisor. This is number eight, Crudo. So it's very close to where we live. So we Shows, thought... Shows our neighborhood just uh, here is uh, to the market. Yeah, so it's it's right opposite Judah Market, which we really should... This is the, uh, the best place for street food come to crack off like seven or eight really good food trucks and then we're just really you go down this way right at the beginning of uh kaiji let's go so crudo here we come so we so, got inside it's beautifully socially distanced yeah can i show it's just through I think, I think we're on a winner eating on sunday nights especially on a cold sunday night places are quiet and naturally socially distanced it's perfect for us so we got our menus. So this is the eighth, eighth most highly rated restaurant in Krakow by TripAdvisor's viewers. Right. It's in our neighborhood. So very, very. It's the closest one to us. And <laughs> first time we're here. Yeah, it's surprisingly. Five minutes. We've passed it many times. Didn't know it was a top ten. There is a kitchen. Entrance so. is over there. Crudo, 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 undos. Isn't that what we. What was that song? Uno, uno, uno. Crudo, crudo, crudo. The glass is by the. The wine by the glass, nice choice. I really like Rioja, I like Malbec, Sangiovese, and Chile. All of those wines are a nice choice, I think. And I feel like a little bit of gin. Okay, let me. Gin. Drinks. Oh, you having the. Bombay sapphire, I think, with some tonic. Can I? You're looking very gorgeous tonight, my love. Thank you. Special. Ah. <laughs> Thank you. Know. Maybe just, it's your late just, birthday meal since it was I on a true. weekday. I didn't go uh, uh, out for my birthday because we yeah. been a little bit like oh, all this. Yeah, we were, that's right. Disease. So, a top 10 restaurant. It's good, yeah? Yeah, it's like we book, like if you reserve it for us. Like if you reserve it <laughs> it's for It's a good us. job I reserved. Nobody else here. I know, well, that's good though. That means we're gonna get royal treatment. Okay, time for the menu. Ooh. Put on a squash, no thank you. Smoked sturgeon, I think the Russian girl might like a bit of sturgeon. <laughs> roast, ooh, roast beef roasted at low temperature. That wouldn't be bad. Beef tenderloin, ta -ta. oh no, here we go, soups. Oh yes, on the Mushroom soup, yes. Goulash soup, yes. Creamy crayfish soup, yes. Salad, not on a cold January night, I don't think. Main courses. 
duck leg. This is what I was telling you about. The duck leg was duck leg. rated highly. Beef cheeks. Legs of rabbit. Well, they won't be very big. Rabbits don't have very big legs. They have a big, I like them. They'll be like tiny little legs. No, they're like uh, chicken legs. Pulled lamb. Oh yes, that's that's a, that's in contention. John Dory, octopus. Oh, I like the mix of fish and meat. Just, one of each. just a wine. I swap <laughs> from white to Keto red. <laughs> By oh, there's a dish here that's a hundred. Wow, the bottom ones are. 98 slotty grilled octopus. Gr whole? Or oh, just like octopus leg? <laughs> octopus. Oh, octopus. <laughs> oh, baby. And then there's. Ooh, beef tenderloin limousine. Wow. That sounds awesome. Great. Some pastas. Pasta with duck. And then on the desserts. Oh, this is really good. This is a chef's restaurant. Okay. Great. I'm happy. <laughs> you must choose. Where was, I? Where was I? Legs of rabbit. Pulled lamb. John Dory. Grilled octopus. That must be a speciality. Look at this beef tenderloin limousine. Oh, wow, wow, wow. Oh. Bombay sapphire and tonic. Nice start. It's the spot. So. Oh. This is how you're struggling to <laughs> to choose something. Among big rights, right? Okay. Everything, oh, thank you. Choice of wines. Hi, I'm back. I'm back. So you, you ordered, yeah? You made an order. I ordered. Mush bush, bush. <laughs> mush bush. Mush bush. It's a bit of mush bush. Moose bush. I heard cottage cheese, some white fish, herbs. That's it. Missed some Love of the rest chef. of what he said from the chef. <laughs> okay. It's gone. Nina's had gone before mm. I could turn the camera on. I just well, was I, right I, in I time to ask, what I'm eating? Very delicate. It's mm. very nice. White fish is bright. Mm. Great oh, flavor. Of the crunch. Something's giving a nice crunch. Mm. White fish and um, cream cheese or something like them. Great. Yeah, very nice. Very what wine do you have? You want wine? Malbec. Your favorite. Okay, mm -hmm. cheers. I also like. Thank you. Rioja. Mm -hmm. How's your wine? Mine is a very flavored texture. Mine is soft, very quiet, relaxing. Now, um, one of the ones that we liked in the summer, Intra Ligatonia, is Mine? number seven. So, one place ahead of this. Okay, we know that place. Intra Ligatonia. Are we going to go there too? No, I'm going to use the footage that we have oh, from okay. the summer. But I'm going to put, I'm going to do number seven and number eight in one video. Right. Okay. Every Sunday we will go to one of the top ten. Okay. Well, 
buckwheat pancakes, right? And sturgeon? Yes, yes, exactly. And uh, mousse, cream mousse of beetroot, made of beetroot. What do you got? Mushroom soup. Well, I'm going to say mushroom soup, but that's a, that's a terrible description of it. Because it's... Look at that. It's a masterpiece. Look at that. Look at that. Mm. That is stunning. It's gorgeous. You know, you know I love mushroom flavor. It's like intense. I can't feel mm. that flavor even from here, like really. How it smells. What about this mousse is really, I don't know. Oh. Just the flavor is gorgeous. Zupa Baravikova, tak? Exactly uh, what I was thinking. Mm. Okay, perfect. So sturgeon with buckwheat, buckwheat blini. How suitable for a little uh, okay, taste test? And this is creme fresh made of beetroot. Oh wow! Yeah. So I, I suppose Look at this. this. This is a foodie place. This is definitely a foodie place. And a little bit of salt. And this is just number eight. If this is number eight, what uh, number uh, one to five going to be like? Cutters. Yeah. Mm. Mm. <laughs> we know we have to count how many Ever M's. Warm. Yeah. Sturgeon too. Mm -hmm. Yeah. You should know your Russian sturgeon and blini. Sturgeon is great fish. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Happy. Mm. And kurke also kurke. Happy. Very nice. I would like to try. We're doing well here. Just notice the very familiar bottles. The design wine, of wine. 19 crimes, right? 19 crimes. Yeah. And we saw that in Los Angeles. We didn't yeah. see that here. Yeah, we saw it in Los Angeles and we bought it a couple of times. Popular 19 crimes. If it's that one. Maybe not. Let me check. <laughs> It's not sad anything, but it's at matsu. Matsu. Here's the wine. Arresty. Yeah. Super. Thank you. Enjoying this. So Nina has rabbit, rabbit leg, with some pasta. Yeah, it's cruel. Yeah, for somebody it can be cruel, but. Uh, very, very it's bigger good. than I thought. That was a big rabbit. Right. That's a piece of chicken. Oh, there we go. Mm. Mm. Very gentle, Yep, and? Mm. Very good. Look at this. I'm just going to hold this pose for a while. Mm. The colors. I wish I could tell you everything that's on here. So mine was cooked in a cream sauce. Yeah. Mm. That's a winner. It's too good to eat. Yeah. Oh. A little bit of whatever that is. Mm. Oh. Perfection. <laughs> it's a very familiar face. Oh, no, no, <laughs> face, no. face expression. No, it's not a familiar face. No. Oh, flavor on that. That jumps out at you. Oh. What is that now? So, what is the garnish? Okay. What is on top of the Mushrooms, yeah. Okay. There's um. Potato gratin, kumus. How is it? Even we ask. Oh, That's amazing. Just enjoying it. Thank wow. you. 
I don't need it. No, no so you. not for me. Thank you. Please you. Thank you. Uh, wow. I, I'm, wow, wow. I don't know. I didn't. That is like elevator. What is on the top, my love? It's uh, like. Uh, Leeks. Leeks, right? Leeks, mushrooms, potatoes, some mousse. Okay, come on. You gotta try this. Seriously? You're Seriously, you gotta try it. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Mm. Good meal. Mm. Mm. Good meat. Good meat. <laughs> okay. Good. I don't remember the okay, last time. Okay, it's good. Perfectly, perfectly. It's Perfection. the flavor. Flavor is good, right? Oh. Is it beef or it's what a real? What a fantastic piece! No, it's beef. What a fantastic piece of beef! Wow. For beef, very nice. For beef, it's very real. It's a success, big success. Mm. You know. <laughs> if mm. Jed said that it's good, it's good beef. He knows his beef. <laughs> that is just worth it. It's worth it for that mouthful. <laughs> That's excellent. That really is excellent. What's the sauce? Is it just like juice of meat or it's I think some... it's it's like a gravy or right? a sauce. Oh, gravy, it's, right. Mm. It definitely adds to okay, it. Okay, you like mushrooms. Mm -hmm. Are they champignons? Mm-hmm. Mm. Mm. And always, of course, I love my potato. Okay. Mm. Oh. That's fantastic. I personally can't taste a lot of difference between rabbit and chicken. This is lovely. Mm -hmm. Thank you for the mouthful. That's really nice. The flavors, the, the thing about this restaurant is the flavors they're cooking with. Mm. They really enhance whatever you eat. It. Like, the flavor combinations are fantastic. This baby is, <laughs> this is fantastic. The potato is fantastic. The leeks are fantastic. I'm really, really liking my idea of trying the top 10 restaurants. Nina suggested I try the Chilean wine. Mm -hmm. Fantastic. Yeah, we just swap. Yeah. The only thing I'm not like a massive fan of is the mushrooms, because the mushrooms in the soup had a stronger flavor. But this piece of beef will live in the memory. I'm going to say, this is one of the best pieces of beef I've ever had anywhere. But how it's cooked, yeah? It really it's like cooked food. perfectly, the actual meat itself Did they ask you, like, is how we phenomenal. Like yeah, medium. This medium? is medium. Mm -hmm. It looks more like medium rare, but the spices on it are just perfect. Like, it wasn't a big piece of meat. But I can't remember having a piece of beef that I've enjoyed so much on my palate. Even though it's small, every little, every little tiny piece of it just packs flavor. <laughs> it's the most expensive dish on the menu here. It's yeah. not, a, it, it's an expensive dish by local standards. Once you get into three figures, that's kind of really unusually hard. Yeah. Remember what we had for dessert last week? No, no, that was at home. Yeah. In the restaurant, what did we have for dessert? Uh, don't we had pierogi. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. Oh, yeah. This is good, pierogi. We had pierogi for dessert, which we liked. Mm -hmm. I want steak for dessert. Also, uh, it was all an ordinary, yeah? not ordinary pierogi. It was yeah, it was whole wheat. Yeah. Last week's video, if you want to check it out, mm -hmm. whole wheat pierogi was yeah, very nice. Okay, three choices for dessert. Not too complicated. What would you choose, viewers? Brown butter ice cream, apple sorbet, or fresh fruit coolie, white chocolate raspberry ice cream. I know which one I would choose. 
last one. Yeah. <laughs> Me too. It'd be small though. Okay. You want one each? Like two desserts. Mm. And these appeared from somewhere. Vodka something. Vodka something. Sweet? Mm -hmm. Plum or Plum? something. Mm -hmm. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, later, 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 later. Uh, what later? So we have fruit crumble with a coolie raspberry ice cream. Nina has got. What daddy ordered for her? I don't remember. <laughs> White chocolate something. White chocolate something. Because I said I don't need the dessert you ordered for me. I know, but it's not very big. Ooh. Well, that's got the coolie. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Look at okay, that. Okay, go for it. Oh. Kill it. Open it. Well, that was harsh. Oh, my. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, oh. oh there we have got some images tonight. <laughs> Heaven, mm. heavenly. Okay. I just tried yours. That was fantastic. Oh. Oh. The crumble is like hard. I love that. I absolutely. I love crumble. And I really like it when the crumble is like crystallized like that. Oh, <laughs> that brings back memories, childhood memories. Oh, mm. superb. Super delicious. Mm. Wow. Is that a pea? Looks like a pea. Blueberry. Mm. Great that you enjoy. Yes, I did. I miss it. Do it again. Yeah. That's a good sign. <laughs> mm. Yours made me dance. Mm. Mm. Really, really good. Bad curry, vodka stuff. <laughs> no. Fruity? Ooh. It just like Did it put hairs on your chest? <laughs> Salute. Cheers, cheers. Beautiful. Wow. Such a different reaction than yours and mine. Show it again, show it again. <laughs> <laughs> wow, that warms you up on a cold January night. Mm. I love Polish. <laughs> yes, for sure. Kudo, kudo, kudo. Mm. Oh, take him, take him home. Okay, I was uh, indulgent with the steak. What can I tell you? Ah, so. Yes, indeed. Top 10. Gatonia. Traditional Polish cuisine in a modern version. So they're just cleaning the table for us. And to continue our fun weekend, we came to Inso Legatonia, which is a quite beautiful Nina. 
which is a Polish restaurant but with food done in a modern way. So. We saw this menu outside and had a nice range of seafood options so Nina is, is the seafood fan out of the two of us so she could go this way. Beef meats, hello Jed, and then other meats. Now what I noticed they had is lamb. I haven't I haven't had lamb yet since I came. It says goose meat dumplings What's with a brown sauce. It just said a brown sauce. What's a brown sauce? Well, I don't know. I have to admit, I had a little taste already. Stunning, yeah. I think we've discovered. We, I think we've discovered ourselves a little winner at this place. Is this pierogi I like? Ah. We shared. We shared them. Beautiful. Yeah. Cheers. Cheers. Like pork knuckle. It's lamb knuckle. It's lamb, right? Lamb knuckle. Potato, mixed vegetables, some celery, some leek, carrot, oh my God. peppercorn. And what sauce? Oh, red wine. Sauce. And my beef cheeks. Mine is, wow, look at that, look at that texture already, I can say. It's just like, oh. Shall we try a little bit? Oh my God, the lamb is just falling off the bone. That's just, that's just like, my first lamb in Poland. My love. <laughs> it's okay, it's okay, no, nice. Mm. Oh. oh, it's so nice, it's so moist. Amazing, amazing. Look how it's solid, this meat. Mm -hmm. But indeed, when you take it, it just dissolves, dissolves. Very it's the sweet, same with the lamb. Very sweet, rich. Mm. Can you introduce me what you Yeah, got? well, first of all, they gave us another freebie, which is their homemade liqueur. Which is uh, what do they say? Black currant and strawberry. Raspberry. Strawberry. And it's delicious. I gotta say the service here is excellent. And what it's, about it? <laughs> it's chocolate souffle and a baby cabbage. <laughs> baby cabbage looks amazing. Oh, chocolate souffle. It's like volcano. Great, great. Now I want the coffee. Oh, Jesus. Jesus. Wow. That's like so much lighter than you imagine it to be. Like chocolate to bake would be one of the heaviest desserts, but this is like light as a feather. Oh, wow. Great, great. How about cabbage? Cabbage roll. <laughs> My love, look at me. I'm not gonna. My I'm love, not look gonna... at me. Your eyes are just something else. Thank you. My love, I'm, I don't want to spoil the ice cream for you. I want you to try it. I will. 